Hey Instagram, so today I am just gonna give you a few hip thrust variations. So Joe's given you a barbell hip thrust and taking you through that previously. And now we're just gonna give you a few variations just to mix it up. Um, so the first one you can do is a banded hip thrust and you can either do this on the bench or the ball. You're gonna pop a band around the top of your knees. Shuffle down so your mid back's on the bench, just like with the barbell hip thrust. Now importantly, as Joe would have spoken about, you're thinking about posteriorly tilting the hips because you want to get full glute recruitment. So you want to think about tucking the hips under, belly button in. Then you're going to squeeze your bum, take your hips into the sky, head back. All the way down, tuck the hips, squeeze the bum, head back. That's on your bench. You can also do that on your ball. Grab a Swiss ball, bit of instability here. Knees wide against the band. Again, hips down, tuck the hips. Hips all the way up, tuck the hips. Hips all the way up. Number two, you can add your single leg hip thrust. Again, bench or ball doesn't really matter. Hands can go down if you're on the ball for a bit of stability. Down, up, down, up. Similar thing, you're thinking about tucking those hips under and bring your knee closer to your chin to help you get that posterior tilt, yeah? Rather than having it all the way out here, knee to chin. Do the same thing on the bench, and there's your variations. Give them a crack. 